Hello everyone, I'm Joshua Quinn with Lighty Contractors, and today I'm going to talk to you about how to prepare a concrete floor for peel and stick tiles. Now for this job, you'll need a couple things. Now for this job, you will need a cleaner. Make sure that the cleaner doesn't have an oil base to it, because that'll prevent the peel and stick tiles from actually sticking to the concrete. So you want something that is a water base that will evaporate. You can use a mop or something like that. In this case, I'm going to just be using a scrubber to show you what to do. So the first thing we'll do is take our cleaner and put it onto the concrete. You want to put it on there pretty heavy. That way you can pull all the dirt out of all the grooves and everything. Take your scrubber and just start scrubbing it around. After that, we put a little bit more water on there and wipe off all the dirt. Now the main reason that you're cleaning this floor really well is to get all of the dirt and dust off of there. That way your adhesive can actually have something to stick to. It works great on concrete because there are so many grooves and it's kind of a rough surface, so it bonds really well to it. But as you can see here, the sponge is filthy. If you just tried to lay it right over the top of that, it wouldn't stick but for a couple of days. So you want to make sure you get it as clean as possible. If you want to, you can actually put a sealant over the top, like a sealant paint, to try to hide all the dirt underneath and actually give it something to stick to. I'm Joshua Clement with Lighty Contractors, and we just talked about how to prepare concrete for peel and stick tile. Thanks for watching, and good luck with this project.